it's been a while since I've posted anything and I thought uh, today now would be a good time. Yes, you might have noticed this is a different scene, background for the video. And um, well, it's the same little stream, just a little bit further downstream. Lovely little place. As you can see, spring is really here and it's looking great. I'm privileged to be able to come here in the time that we are currently experiencing because um, I can get here without meeting any other person, which is wonderful and uh, legally also great because it is allowed. It's a great time to let the dog out a little bit and walk about and enjoy the world. A theme that's occupying everybody these days, um, if you haven't heard about it, you're probably living, I don't know, in Tastikistan or somewhere else. And um, the theme is the current, well, situation concerning the health of the world's population, be it a um, conspiracy theory or reality or whatever else. I know where I stand on the matter and um, it's firmly in the reality of it. Reality is, a couple of days ago I experienced uh, symptoms. Uh, I have the privilege as also the, um, how would you say it, well, the difficulty of having one of these professions which means that I get to spend a lot of time working still because it's necessary and um, it's not medical or anything like that but I do have contact with a fair number of other people and um, yes last week I had some of the symptoms quite seriously headaches and stuff like that went to the doctor they kept the long distance from me and I got myself tested about an hour ago I got the results and um, yes I am negative but I can tell you that the three days because of the weekend that um, I waited were absolute hell. There's obviously this, um, well, relatively healthy, yes, and um, I shouldn't be in the endangered group, be there, but um, it doesn't mean anything really in reality. And um, therefore, there was fears about me, but also fears about people I have had contact with and who they have contact with. And everybody of us has one or two people directly or indirectly we have contact with who form part of what this in danger group is. And um, therefore, thoughts should not be about ourselves. Um, we should look after ourselves at any time. But um, the real thought is about how we deal with other people around us. There are rights. Yes, the right to go around and do what you want to do and within certain legal aspects. But... I think what's paramount here is the right to life. And um, if your behavior, be it whatever, um, in terms of any other thing, endangers the life of others, you should seriously give it some thought. Because um, we should be entering a time in our human development, which is where we actually take care of our, our next of kin, where we start thinking as a species and not as an individual. I've touched on these themes of um, the future of mankind and such like in my other videos. But um, right now, it's the aspect of community. Yes, the individual should be lifted by the community or the individual good above the good of the community. But in, only, in order to make this balanced, the individual should lift the community above the community's needs above their own. Only this way a balance can be achieved, which will be mutually beneficial. We're going to come out of this changed. Life is changing. Life changes every day. It doesn't take a virus. It doesn't take a major event of um, which brings people together or splits them apart. Life is changing. This is a fact. It always will and it always does. How you go about with this change is a testament of who you are, 
nothing less. And um, how you think about this change and how you deal with this change, again, a testament to who you are. You have to decide who you are and you have to deal with the change. You can't stay in the past. The past is past, the future is still coming. And this is just a fact of life. I'm relieved. Means this uh, possible immunity that is um, in the future on my cards is uh, not yet a reality. And I will have to go on dealing for myself. And, um, but also considering the possibility that I might at some point not be negative, I have to deal with the way I'll go around with my daily life and protect those who need protecting. So basically, this is one of many tests we as mankind, as individuals of mankind, will be going through and have gone through. And the way we deal with it is um, a testament and also will eventually prove whether or not we survive as a species and we su survive with those things we hold dear, dignity, love, humanity. The list is endless. Just think about it. That's all I ever ask.